morning, morning, friends. Good morning, friends. Good morning, friends. Good morning, friends, and welcome to Family Worship. It is so great to be with you this morning. If you have a candle or a light, let's go ahead and turn that on. That represents the light of Christ joining us today. Well, friends, today we're going to learn about the early church, the early Christians, the very first Christians, and how they helped grow the church. But first, we're going to sing a song. So let's all stand and sing our very first song. If I sink to the depths of oceans, even there, there you are Before me, behind me, above me, below me You surround me, you sustain me, promise that you'll always keep me Before me, behind me, above me, below me You surround me, you sustain me, promise that you'll always keep me Today's story comes from the book of Acts. Sometimes it's called the Acts of the Apostles, the actions of the early Christians, the things that they did. Well, in today's story, they had to come together to solve a problem, and they created a solution. Let's go ahead and watch today's video. The early church grew and grew. The new Christians loved God. The number of people who were choosing to become Christians was growing so fast, the disciples couldn't keep up. The disciples held a meeting. It is our job to tell people about Jesus. We can't possibly feed the widows and the poor and still have time to teach about Jesus. We need help. They asked the people to select seven believers who are wise and good. These seven people will feed the widows and help the poor. The other believers were happy the disciples chose to find some help. The community of believers continued to grow.
Have you ever said, I don't need any help. I can do it all by myself. I imagine you have. I know when I was a child, I definitely said that. We all need help. And that is exactly what this story was about. The disciples, the early apostles, couldn't do everything on their own as the church was growing. They needed some more leaders. And so that was what they did. They found some leaders. You know, if you play soccer, you have to play with teammates. Not everyone can be the goalie. You would never score. Teamwork makes the dream work. Have you ever heard that one? We all have parts, we all have roles, we all have things we're good at. It's okay to ask for help and to work together, especially to share God's love. That's what Jesus would want us to do. Be a good friend and share God's love. There's something in the air You can see it in the trees It carries us along And gathers up the leaves No matter where we're from Or who we used to be It finds us where we are and gives us eyes to see It calls us out And gives us jobs to do You take care of me And I take care of you oh, There's a strong wind Blowing through the land of God a strong wind blowing through the land of God. Oh, we don't understand how you always break us out. You show up in the dark, in the shadow of a doubt. You change our hearts. You even change our name You give us words And a brand new song to sing About a strong wind Blowing through the land of God With such a strong wind Blowing through the land of God strong wind blowing through the land of God With such a strong wind blowing through the land of God oh there's a strong wind blowing through the land of God With such a strong wind blowing through So now is our time where we can pray together as a family to, to talk with God. So gather together with your family and share some things that are on your heart, some, some praises, some concerns, 
Um, this is this is our time to share these things with each other and to share them with God. So let's go to God together in prayer, praying the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. Friends, I'm so glad we got to spend this time together in worship. I loved hearing about the early church, the early followers of Jesus, how they cared for each other, how they shared, and how they grew new leaders to go out and serve. We're all called to serve, and we're all called to love God. So let's find some ways to help. Help around your home. If you're in school, help at school. Be a good friend. Be a good neighbor. You don't have to be a leader by using your mouth. The best leaders lead with their actions, and that's what we're called to do. So be a good leader. Lead by example. Until next time, friends, go in peace. Bye-bye.